So far in the programme, we've shown you how to save money on a family hatchback. We're trying to save you some money on speeding fines by showing you that if you speed up, you can get round them. And now we're going to give you the biggest money-saving tip of them all. There's been a lot of talk in the uh, newspapers and on the radio this last couple of weeks about people running their cars, their diesel engine cars, I should say, on vegetable oil. There's been so many people trying it that up north, one supermarket train uh, chain is now rationing the amount of oil that it will sell to individuals. Um, now, the thing is, is that you can run a car on vegetable oil. It's not completely brilliant. However, I've been joined here by Jason Taylor. You reckon you've got a little additive that makes the whole thing better, yeah? Yeah. So what we've got here is some normal vegetable? That's uh, used vegetable oil from a Mexican restaurant. Used? Used, yeah. Why used? Well, we find it gives it a bit, bit of better power to the engine. Really? So all these bits, we have to strain those out, obviously. So we've got that over here, one of these J-cloths, OK? And in we go. So I'll collect the bits. Look at that. And you reckon this will work? Yeah, it's like golden elixir, that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Does it make the car smell of it? it? It is actually the different restaurants you can tell what you're running it on. <laughs> Seriously? Yeah. So if we run a car on this, it's going to... a little essence of where it came from. Yeah. OK, that's in there like that. Fine. Now, what have you worked out you have to add to that? Right. Well, just to make it a bit, a bit more runnier, you add uh, a solvent. And for this experiment, we've got a non-kerosene-based white spirit. Okay. It has to be non-kerosene-based for tax reasons. OK, and how much do we have to put in? Uh, in, in a litre... in 97 millilitres of uh, vegetable oil, put three millilitres of... That's in there. So it's about that much. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's just get that, pull that over here. Okay, so we add that. Okay, and then we uh, whisk it up. We get it all well, actually, there. you don't really need to risk, uh, whisk it, but. Uh, so is that ready to go now? Yeah, it's ready to. Well, no, you should let it stand for at least a week or so. And how much does that cost for a litre? About three pence plus the tax. Oh, you have to pay tax? Mm. But if you didn't tell the customs and excise, that's 3p. If you do tell them. You have to tell them. OK, of course, you have to tell them. <laughs> you have to tell them, right? And how much are they going to charge? Uh, 26 pence, but check with your local custom, customs and excise office. It's about 29p a litre. You've got to fill mm. a couple of forms in. Yeah. 29p a litre. It's just run through. Do you have to modify the engine? No. Just any old diesel will do? Yeah. And, you can, and it's fine? Yeah. Performance? The same as diesel, maybe even better. And you reckon we could tip that into a diesel car? It'll work? Yeah. Got to give that a go, haven't we? This is a Volvo 740. In the front, there's a diesel engine, and in the tank at the back, nothing. It's empty. Listen. Start the engine. Can't start the engine. No fuel. And we can verify that. Look, here we have an independent adjudicator. Bal, you'll verify there's nothing in there. There's nothing in the tank. We've drained off 25 litres. It's completely empty now. Right, brilliant. Well, if we go around the back and look in the boot, we find a big container full of vegetable oil from El Rio's in Macclesfield. Now, we've added a splash of white spirit, and Bal is going to pour that into the tank. Right, it's now been converted from a carnivore into a herbivore. But, of course, being a diesel, you can't just start it. You have to bleed the system first, which you've just done, yes, Bal? Yep, all ready to go. System bled, no airlocks in there. Okay. Good, let's close the bonnet. If you want to step in... And let's see if it starts. If it does, I shall be astonished. That's amazing! <laughs> go, go! 